Hey, my name is Chris Shea, and I did something unexpected. Uh, I was looking for some adjustable dumbbells, and I was pretty certain that I was going to buy power blocks, which is what I'm familiar with. But as I began doing a little more research, as I began looking into what's out there and the new technology that's come about, I came across Bowflex or Nautilus um, new adjustable dumbbells, the 560s. And so I thought about it and I was weighing my options and I went for it. They had a they had an awesome sale going on and there's a money back guarantee and so I did it. I bought a whole set of these Power Block 560s. I got the weights, I got the stand and I got the bench. And so I'm just going to do a little unboxing and put these things together and maybe maybe even a quick review just to show you what to expect if you decide to order something like this. All right, so here's the packaging. Uh, these things are big and heavy. The, the stand is the, the lightest, obviously. Uh, the bench is, is big, heavy, and then the heaviest is obviously the dumbbells themselves. And it looks like they come already assembled, which I'm very happy with. Uh, I didn't want to have to deal with that, but I can put together the stand and the bench, no big deal. So, so one thing that I will say about uh, the Bowflex buying process is that I bought these uh, like around 11 o'clock at night two nights ago and so I did not expect these we have a snowstorm going on right now and so I didn't expect these for like a week or so um, and I got the email yesterday morning saying that they had shipped out and I still I was okay they shipped that's great I'll expect them in a week we'll see what we get and it's the next day so uh, within 24 hours, I got these huge packages on my doorstep in a snowstorm. I didn't pay extra for shipping. In fact, the shipping was free. And so I think that goes to show um, something about the company. This is my first experience with Bowflex. If you have any experiences with them, you know, please drop them in the comments. Let me know. But um, so far, I'm, I'm really pleased that... that they took the time, like the extra effort to get me my product as soon as possible. They didn't let the storm delay them. They didn't give me an excuse or anything like that. They just shipped them and got them right to me. And as a consumer, as, as the person who's buying these things, who's spending quite a bit of money, um, I greatly appreciate that. So thank you, for Bo thank you Bowflex, for, for your um, diligence in that area of this. So let's do a quick unboxing, and then I'll show you what you get. Okay, so as I anticipated, the weights come pretty much completely assembled right out of the box. You just lift them out, set them into the stand. The only thing that you have to put together is the little sensor, right? The Bluetooth sensor, and they give you batteries, uh, and that screws right into here. And that's what allows you to track your reps and use the app that comes along with these. But I, I think you saw me trying them out. So far, I, I, I tried the handle. Everything's really nice. And we'll talk more about the actual dumbbells after we get everything assembled. All right, so this is the stand. You can see, obviously, we have the base and the top, and then this is the holder for your device. Uh, a couple support beams, and then the uh, nuts and bolts are all laid out right there with instructions to put it all together. Uh, so it should be pretty straightforward, but you can watch me put it together here. All right, so when it comes to these parts, um, my order did not ship with instructions as far as I can see on how to assemble the stand. But, thankfully, it's pretty uh, dummy-proof. They've made the bolts different sizes. You see these are big, thick ones. And then you have these little ones here. And so, it's pretty easy to understand. The, uh, the frame only goes together one way. This is a round frame for the top. The, the base is more of a flattened version. And so, all of the heavy components, all of the main frame, use these larger bolts to go together. And these little ones will then be used to affix um, the actual dumbbells to the top of the frame. 
So I hope that makes sense. Um, the other thing I wanted to say is that when you're assembling this, this is actually the top piece that I've made and then I'm gonna turn it upside down and put it on the base. I recommend doing it this way uh, because otherwise when you get to doing these bolts here, you're gonna kind of be upside down or you just flip the whole thing around again. But it's nice that it stands up either way so that you can do that. So I'm gonna continue putting this together and I'll get back with you. Obviously the stand is together now, and now my objective is to put the base plates in place. However, what I'm finding out is that um, they come with these little feet installed on them so that you can set them down on your floor and it won't scrape up your floor, which is nice, right? But in order to screw them to the stand, you need to take these screws out and remove these feet so that those little bolts can then go through the stand and secure these plates in place. However, uh, Bowflex does not give you a screwdriver, they just give you this Allen wrench for the bolts. So, you will need to have your own screwdriver for this installation. Alright, so you can see that I have taken uh, the feet off of this one, they're over here, and now the rubber, the actual rubber part comes off and can stay there and I actually wanted that I thought it'd be nice to have a rubber bumper between these two but it won't work that way you have to take off the whole foot with the rubber leaving just the plate and then the plate will actually key in the place like this so it's very it's pretty stable even without the screws but the screws obviously hold it on there so just a note you'll have to take off the rubber feet and put the plate on All right, so here it is all together. I'm really happy with a very, very sturdy stand. And um, I'm happy with the height. This is less than three feet high. You can see I'm standing in it and you know I have to squat down in order to grab the weight, which means that if I pick, if I bend down and I grab on and I just stand up, I have enough room to take the weight out of the rack. And I'm not tall, I'm 5'8", so this should be a decent size for uh, any person. This is what the bench looks like outside of the packaging. Not too much assembly. Just got the feet to hold this up. You gotta put the uh, boards on there and then if you wanna do the reclining part for your knees to hold on to, that'll go on there too, but not too bad. All right, so there it is. Um, you've probably seen a number of videos on this before, but uh, the Bowflex bench comes up to a number of degrees. You can even decline it then and lift the seat up so that you can do decline sets or use it as an ab bench. Um, so I'm pretty happy with this. And I got my weights and racks set up right over here so I can uh, select a number here just by clicking. Let's go 
something easy so I don't embarrass myself on video. It's kind of a wide uh, seat area that I'm not really used to, but we'll have to see how it goes. Anyway, here we go. Here's a press. See if we can do something a little fancier. So that's it. That's what we have. I have the Selectec 560s over here. Uh, I feel like you're going to get a great range of motion. It's a narrower design. Uh, I love the click, uh, the turn to click weight adjustment. Um, the Bluetooth technology is really cool. I like the idea of it. I don't know how well it's going to work, but I'm going to give it a try and I'm going to see how it goes. Um, the bench is great. And so overall, I am really really happy with this product i got uh you know same as cash through the bowflex credit card for uh, 12 or 18 months or something and i think it's going to end up working out to about 30 bucks a month for me to have all of this equipment and um, i'm excited about this so as far as the dumbbells in comparison to other dumbbells as well as um let's go 17.5 One of the reasons that I like these is not only because of their their um, shorter design, but because of the square build. So the select techs in general are around, which is okay for, for certain moves, but if you wanna use these on the ground, you know, if you're coming in and you're jumping up and you're doing a press and you're coming back down, you need to have a flat, stable weight. And so I really like these. As far as the plates are concerned, I feel like they're durable. Uh, I don't feel like they're going to break. If anything broke on them, it would be the handle uh, because the selection mechanism is plastic. So that would be my only concern. And there's, a, I think, a three-year warranty on these guys. So I don't know. I'm going to try them out. I'm going to see how it goes. And I guess I'll let you know if you have any questions, comments, or uh, concerns that you'd like me to address, shoot me, a, shoot me a message or comment down below, and I'll do my best to let you know uh, what my honest opinion of this is. But um, I'm really pleased with my purchase, and I would recommend them at this point, <laughs> but we'll see how it goes. So thanks for watching.